I mean, just say, say I am gonna vice some of these people and try a little label myself. In Jamaica, there's a party. Beanie, beanie, boy, you come down, man, kids, and you want them whining. Whining, whining, boy, you. And that, that is what blew into this, you know, so. I have to give God thanks, you know. It was like a transfer of artists back here at you and then with um, Bobby and thing and, you know. Because everyone loved Bobby from like, like um, Jammy, so we always, the artists always, they, they move along. Shabba, Peeny Peeny, Lonesome Side, the Coco Tea, Time is So Serious, Admiral Tibet, early set of songs then. Mama Man with Shabba, Drum Spread Out with Flower Gun and Daddy Lizard, Too Much Jealousy, Admiral Tibet, Sweet Baby Brian and Tony Gold. I can't remember those songs out of my head because those, those songs was the first set of songs I gave Dynamics. This is where I started to do something for myself. When Digital hit the scene now for himself, come with Shaba, right? And the, the rest is history. Girls of mercy, I am bad, mad, and no wicked in the bed. I used to do Shabba stuff, early Shabba stuff, I was like, oh, I'm Mr. Boy, I have to find this police so that's when I say, let me find Bobby Digital. This, the two songs that ended up on Shabba's album, as well as ever, it's two songs that I just did, two tracks that I just did, I didn't even know that Shabba would end up on them. Gun for me, and woman tell me, I'm a gun for me, I'm gonna take it off, yeah. When I went back to far now, my profile went up a little bit more. <laughs> my price went up a little bit more. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know, Barry move on and he did very good. We did we get a lot of, lot of hits with Chevron. I love to come, um, Shine and Chris, Wicked in a Bed, and the list goes on. Um, going inside to work, he was outside, you know. Boy, I want a boss, you know. A union specialist. I mean, man, Shaba, you know. From then it started. Uh, he believes in me, I believe in him. I think that he was different, you know. His writing skill, different. What DJs do is what we call it, in other words. You know, so you, you speak as subtly as you want to be. In other words, stop that, you know what I mean? And that is, that is what DJs bring, and Shaba does it so well. In the early 80s, 90s, you know, come to London so we can have a little autograph signing at Tower Records. Kids looted the place. At first we told the people, get some security. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? Shabba Ranks. I said, who the see you going to see later? When Shabba go to this store, it's BBC. He came out on Reggae Riot. The work that Bobby did speak for itself. So I would I would say if it wasn't Bobby Digital the work that he performed, maybe Sony wouldn't have been tested. You know what I'm saying? So I have to give Bobby a thumbs up for that. Shabba was like coming from the underground. Like nobody they didn't expect that uproar and turnout. You understand? Yeah man. So we know that Shabba was something different from that time. Well, he used to have, a, I would say, a signature piece, try to fold pants foot up, you know what I'm saying? But it works here, until we take it over there and turn it into a different, you know, we keep upgrading the Rolex, the different type of stuff. There's a sound, not it's so weird. It's weird, <laughs> it's like I hear about it, until I know it. It's not the size of the studio. It's who are on the board. Something about these little boxes. They might have more vibes, more hit songs come out of there, you know? <laughs> Cause all of my hit songs, they have, most of my hit songs come from those two little boxes. When the jam is on, and we want to go see what it's on. It's a song you have to work. It's not much of really playing. Yeah, playing has something to do with it still, like mission, a type of mission, but, but they have a certain sound. And certain people use a certain sound. So if you want some so certain sounds, you have to come on about to get that song. With sound, with music, it doesn't matter what genre of music you're doing. 
as long as you're getting that sound, what you want to hear. Once you get that, that's why you work with, say, could be lovers rock, could be pop, could be roots rock. As long as you're getting that sound, you work with it. Bobby always get that sound, that, 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 especially me as a drummer. Sometimes you go to different studio, different engineer, you don't get back the same sound like you said, but that, that's not how the sound, but Bobby, you get the true sound from Bobby all the time. You get the true sound, your bass will be pumping because it's beginning you that, like a tube arm, the bass will be, you know, and yeah, everything will be there, you know, pumping and thing because that's, that, that is Bobby vibe. For some reason, something here that, it's just a vibe that creates that thing, you know? I, I go inside there and everything seems to just come out of the walls. You can't go somewhere else about them to say you want to Bobby song. It never work. You have to come and get the kind of a certain way of doing things. I, I found that round at Bobby, I would go there early in the morning and that would happen. That would happen. You got some old vintage stuff that that's, they said you must recognize the past to assure the future. But that's what it is now. You know, everything changes, but if you want that sound, you have to go see Bobby. Then the little studio now, the, what, what I call it, the backroom studio. A great studio, great sound from that studio. Yeah, man, it's great. Very, very great studio. Yeah, the sound in there is awesome. There's something about a small space. And I'm glad he never really liked to get a big, there's something about that vibe of the cramped, I don't know if it's the cramped energy or whatsoever, but I don't know. I can't tell you that this dude have a sound. Eh? We don't really hear it no else. Nah. <laughs> yeah, the dude itself have a sound. And if you would end this dude that work and you work alongside Bobby, you, 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 you get a sound. Bobby have a great sound, he have a good hearing. I like know him thing. <laughs> you know it. <laughs> the first hit song come out of this place, huh? That's ever okay, can remember you know. Um Sanchez, you know. You're, you're not, not alone. alone. And I can't wait. Now that yes, we are yes, together, yeah. I can wait till the morning comes. That's a great thing about power place now when they come here, that's feel that vibe, that strength, the energy, you know. I feel like you, you miss your home. You come and you feel comfortable. Yeah, it's fine, Mike. It's fine, by this song. Go back in time, brother. Now let's give thanks and praise unto the Most High. Joe Rastafari. King of all kings. Who are Dean Fraser and background vocals. Wrong move, Dalton Brown the guitar. From West Florida, Danny Bassey. Yeah. And this drum track was Titimus, you know? Titimus. Yeah. To carry on, give us strength. Mighty Jaja, give us strength. And no harder. Children the working harder day and night, striving to survive. Striving to survive. Listen, lots of things to take care of. When I started up the studio and you know Garnet and Rebel would have just walk home from run so come check me and you know, all the vibes and Garnet our bridge in him. Collins, Kalo. So what man did he live in? He came here one day and saw me vice in Garnet, you know. And he looked for me and said, Bobby, what are you doing? Them things there, I mean, I think they're going to work, you know. And I said, hey, you're not going to work. All right, then you're not going to see if they're not going to work. Yeah, man. So the man tell me that, man, it's like I have this drive to go a little harder. The conviction, you, know, you can hear a man what delivering from his heart, not just lip. You feel, you feel something different. 
Let's get cool bands. Yeah, yeah. Give us strength. Our Father who art in Give us strength. Bobby is always into new acts, so that would have given Bobby that edge, you know, because he knew when he had something good, when he had something new and good. When Garnet still used to come in this studio here at night time, man, 